contigo. Yo sé. Hagamos que hay. No, no oigo. No, no. Ah. Can you listen to me now? Now, yes. Oh, very good. Okay. Thank you. Thank you there. I got problems here. Okay. Good afternoon. On time. Good afternoon. On time. <laughs> More or less. Yeah, no, no, no. It's okay. Yesterday you were late. For me, yes. Yeah. For, for me, late is um, three minutes later. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, mm -hmm. because you are always very punctual. Yeah. Yeah, I see that. Very good. Nice. Ready to finish? Well, I, today I was teaching my class in the morning, Eduardo, and then I said, okay, for, for uh, Thursday, you have to do this and this activity. So you have two days, I said, to do the, 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 the activity. And my students told me, teacher, tomorrow is Thursday. And I was like, uh, wow, nice. the time Speaking. goes so fast. Exactly. Fast. So tomorrow yes. we finish classes with you, and then the next week and we finish module. Mm -hmm. oh, so fast okay but i think this is this is because we are very busy right yeah this uh, the, the, the you saw the, the did you, you see mm -hmm. did, did you see the the video the wedding video? the wedding the wedding video the wedding video yeah the wedding no where did you get it from huh where did you get it from today in the morning <laughs> <laughs> you were checking. You were yeah, checking it's, the. It's a it's a uh, the the same topics we talk uh -huh. just, uh, about yesterday. Yes. Uh huh. Exactly. The different. Uh, I I am. I'm the mo the modern you. the modern the modern people what what they can can do. <laughs> it, it's it's very it's very different, right, from the past. Mm -hmm. Yes. A lot different. A lot different. A lot Sometimes, different. Uh, well, I don't know. What do you prefer, the past weddings or the present ones? No, the present. Mm -hmm. The present. Yeah, and they but, are beautiful. Mm -hmm. Where is they, where where is this? Uh, when I when I watched the video at the beginning, it just came up to my mind a place in Guatemala. There is ah. a place beautiful like the. Yeah. like the what the video is showing beautiful place i don't remember the name lake. exactly the lake. It, there is mm, it is not a lake well uh, in guatemala there is a place that is panajachel no no it's not panajachel it's not a lake okay. it's like a pond ah. una laguna inside a, a place so you go there you have fun you can uh, go uh, you know by boats so relaxing mm. So when I saw the beginning of the video, I just remember that place in Guatemala. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's it. Yeah, it's, 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 it's true. But uh, your ceremonies are very similar, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. With bows, uh, celebration in the church. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the, I see the, that. The, the talk in the, in, the, mm -hmm. in the kingdom hall, but mm -hmm. the, the celebration is in a, in a whole... In, in a uh, different place. Yeah, in different places. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. For example, a, 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 a conference room, I don't know, something like that, okay? Like a cafe maybe here in El Salvador, in a hotel, right? Mm -hmm. Sala de té. Una sala de té, right? That's it. But it's the same uh, white dresses and everything, right? Mm -hmm. Uh-huh, that's it. No, they are, they are very nice, okay? Today we are going to uh, talk about... Well, kind of, no, maybe weddings, uh, focus on weddings, but we continue talking about the past, the present, and the future, mm -hmm. half of the class. And then the half of the class, we are going to start with the with other topic, okay, with vocabulary. It's, it's not so difficult. And tomorrow we're going to finish, right, with that topic, right? Because next week we are going to have section five, and practically we're going to finish with that. Mm -hmm. That's it. So I'm going to share with you uh, here. Okay, yesterday I remember, right, uh, Eduardo, we were talking about 
Changes, right? Changes. Changes, uh -huh. Uh -huh. Let me check here, okay, this part. Okay, let me, I'm sorry. Let me just check something here because I'm not really sure about my internet. Okay, very good. Okay, how many years have you been living in your neighborhood, Eduardo? In Santa how many Tecla? Years? Mm -hmm. How many years? <clears throat> uh it, when i i start to my to, to my work to my job mm -hmm. this one or the first one the first one in, in <gasps> the first one in 1990 seven Se <gasps> no 1987 uh-huh no way yes my my uncle uh-huh in, in house of my uncle, I I, I uh, estaba de pupilo. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You were living with him. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. Yeah, because you are from originally from Santa Ana, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. And and in this in, in these years in mm -hmm. 19, 1987, <clears throat> I uh, rent a uh, uh, what is a uh, un cuarto? A room. Mm -hmm. A room. Ah, with with other other uh, with with a roommate. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. and, and then you decided to move with your uncle. No, the the, the first, I I I. You live, live with your uncle. uncle. Then you live with a roommate. In a roommate, and mm -hmm. then to the end of these years, mm -hmm. my family. Uh, come with with me. Mm -hmm. Santa mm -hmm. Ana se, nos trasladamos. Yeah, you moved to, from Santa Ana to San Salvador. Santa Tecla. A Santa Tecla. Oh, yes, La Libertad, right? Uh -huh. Oh, my God. So you have a lot of years living there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 30, a lot. 30, 32 years. 32 years. Oh, so you can tell me, so you can tell me very well the changes of your neighborhood, right? The big changes. <laughs> big changes. Uh, the big changes. Uh -huh. for, for example, uh, the I remember the 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 weather. Mm -hmm. Oh. The weather. Mm -hmm. The weather changes very uh, a lot. Uh, uh, I remember. La neblina, ¿cómo se dice? The fog. The fog. I remember I, all nights. For uh -huh. the nights in, oh. in the streets, uh -huh. in the so it lights. Was, so it was foggy. Foggy. Uh -huh. Nublado, uh -huh. Wow, Nublado. very and cold, right? Yeah. Cold. Very cold. But I saw tennis. a picture, you know, Eduardo. I saw a picture uh, maybe maybe one week ago. I don't remember when exactly, but I was checking my Facebook and I saw a picture uh, comparing uh, all the way from. Uh, Multiplaza, uh, the shopping centers, right? Mm -hmm. Multiplaza, La Gran Vía, Las Cascadas, so in the street from Jerusalem Street, uh, the past and the present. In the past, yeah. it was a beautiful forest. Yeah, I remember that. You remember that? So that's why it was very cold. Yeah. Because they... there were a lot of trees. Okay, in mm -hmm. the, the, the Espino Park, mm -hmm. no, it's, this is the Bicentenario Park. Bicentenario Park. park. Uh, I remember the uh, parrots, many parrots each oh, morning. Oh, really? And, and today, uh, I, there don't, aren't. I don't see, no. Nah. Uh -huh. Yeah, I don't see any parrots or, <clears throat> or, or, or animals. Maybe in the park, Bicentenario Park, but just because obviously they have to be there but no a lot like before right yeah. uh-huh okay yeah, I, I remember el parque de los pericos uh, uh, was the name ah uh, really the name, uh, yeah the, the parque de los pericos and I, nobody nobody did anything right no like to stop that deforestation mm -hmm. yeah i mean i visit those shopping centers but i <laughs> But I rather, you know, I rather have lots of trees around me than cement, <laughs> a lot of mm -hmm. cement. 
Okay. Well, yes. this is this is part of what we're gonna be discussing for the first hour. Okay. Well, the first half an hour, it's about this this part. Okay, related to the changes, right? Neighborhood. Okay. I have a conversation here, and I wanna play it for you. Then you're okay. gonna read it. Okay. And then we have the second part of the conversation. Let's let's listen to this part. Unit nine. Times have changed. Page 58, exercise two, conversation. That's progress. Part A, listen and practice. This neighborhood sure has changed. I know. A few years ago, not many people lived here, but the population is growing so fast these days. Remember how we used to rent videotapes at that little video store? Yeah. Now it's a multiplex cinema. And I hear they're tearing down our high school. They're going to build a shopping mall. Soon there will be just malls and parking lots. That's because everyone has a car. Fifty years ago, people walked everywhere. Nowadays, they drive. That's progress, I guess. Okay, that's it. Vocabulary, Eduardo? There is something maybe that you don't know? Uh, no. Everything is fine? The, the only is tearing down. Ah, uh, tearing down. Okay, tearing I hear down. they are tearing down our high school. This is like, están demoliendo. Okay, ah. uh -huh, tearing down our high school, right? Okay. Okay, good. So I'm going to be Tanya, you're Matt. Okay, <laughs> I'm going to check your pronunciation here. This neighborhood sure has changed. I know a few years ago, not many people lived here, but the population is growing so fast these days. Remember how we used to rent videotapes at that little video store? Yeah, now it's a multiplex cine cinema. And I hear they are tearing down our high school. They are going to build a shopping mall. Soon there will be just malls and parking lots. That's because uh, everyone has a car. 50 years ago, people walk every, everywhere. Everywhere? No, mm -hmm. Everywhere nowadays, they drive. That's progress, I guess. Okay, now we're going to substitute. Okay, Eduardo? <laughs> You're going to substitute it with uh, Santa Tecla, okay? Okay. That's it. This neighborhood sure has changed. This is, uh, mm -hmm. what, uh, sorry, I, I substitute what? You substitute the information. For example, here, I know a few years ago, not many people live here in Santa Tecla, but ah. the population is growing. This okay. is okay. But then I uh, yellow at this here. Remember how we used to, how we used to see a lot of birds around uh, okay oh yes now it's a multiplier i don't know ah uh, okay <laughs> that's it okay this I neighborhood tried. okay this neighborhood sure has changed i know a few years ago uh uh a lot of birds mm -hmm. lived here <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. in the in the trees in the in the trees in in the neighborhood of Santa Tecla. Oh, remember how we used to take pictures of those birds and parrots in the afternoon? Pictures. Uh huh. Pictures. No. <laughs> no, with the cell phone, no, with cameras, no, uh, with we, the we rollo. No, no. <laughs> I, I remember my first camera. Uh huh. Was, uh, I, I bought. When. When I married, uh, we married. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Cuando nos casamos, compré. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Your first camera. The first wow. Camera. Okay, okay, okay. Well, I, I, I'm going to change it. Remember yeah. how we used to listen to those parrots and birds singing about 5 p.m.? <laughs> yeah, I, uh, I remember, but not now. Now it's, it's a... Uh, uh, Multiplaza Mall and La Gran Villa Mall in, in oh, these places. Yeah, it's a pity. I hear they are going to make a new building. Uh, 
for a uh, apartment, uh -huh. for apartments. In a gran villa. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah, I, Ese es porque no tienen casa, diga. <laughs> that's because? That's because they don't have a, a house. Uh -huh. 50 years ago. Uh -huh. 50 years ago, uh, the people... Uh, Both houses. Mm -hmm. Both houses. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, and nowadays there is no space to make a house. And then, well... Yeah. I think that's well, progress. <laughs> this is the progress. It's yeah. similar, similar to the Roberto Carlos song. Yeah. You know? yeah. Which one? I know some Roberto Carlos songs. El but Progreso. El the progreso. name is El Progreso. Ah, no, no, I don't know then. No, I just uh, know, I just canto know maybe a couple. Canto, canto un poquito. Uh, uh, do go ahead. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, sí, pues. I, I don't know the... Yo quisiera ver, yo quisiera ser como los animales, eh, pero es, dice, navegar sin hallar tantas manchas de aceite en los mares oh, y ballenas ah. desapareciendo por falta. Oh, my God. Comerciales. The progress. The pro, yo quisiera ah, ser civilizado so. como los animales, así dice. Ah, uh, oh, very nice. So sí. it's, not, it's not a song for love. Ya. Yeah. Ah, uh, it's a song for related to the environment and stuff like that. Yeah, uh, it, people see. say it's progress, but in my personal opinion, I consider that it's not progress. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> because we are we are destroying a lot of things. Believe me, yeah. destroying a lot the, of things. The, I the was, flora uh -huh. and fauna. The flora and fauna, exactly. I don't know, Eduardo, if in the past you, you used to travel on Comalapa Freeway, but in my case, because I lived, you know, I have lived around this place, where in, when I was 10, 11, 12 years old, I practiced, uh, you know, with my father. My father had a hobby. The hobby for my father was the cyclism. So mm -hmm. uh, my sis, my big sister, my my brother and I, and my father, we four, we used to ride our bicycles on Comalapa Freeway, mm -hmm. from <laughs> like long distances. And yeah. I remember Eduardo that on the the walls and Las Peñas on the walls, when we couldn't anymore, like yeah, we were very tired. My mm -hmm. father said, "Okay, it's time to stop." And we had bottles, bottles. And we went there and there were like pilitas. Pilas oh. from water. There were pilas. Ah. You know, pilas de agua uh -huh. de nacimiento. And ¿Sí? we, 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 we collected water from Collect there. Collected water drunk to, to drink. Water. Uh -huh. Yes. On Comalapa Freeway. Can you imagine? Now it has changed a lot. Now that I am driving all the time, by five pilitas, they disappear. Uh, and did, did you remember the toll? In Comalapa. Which one? Toll. Caseta de eh, Pago. Yes, and the, uh, in now it's in, yes, I remember, in eh, Cristo de la Paz. No, I don't know. Right, he, there, ah, near no, San the, Marcos. No, the toll, the toll is in, 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 in when San the Marcos. beginning is in San Marcos, uh -huh. San Santo Tomás. And Santo the, Tomás, there were toll, yes, it's true. Para Salir o entrar. Uh -huh. del, del you comar. paid, right? Yeah. yeah uh -huh. And they gave you a ticket. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I remember. Hey, I it's remember. true. Yeah, it's true. It's true. Uh -huh. In Santana, so, in Santana was the, the, the first, I, I, I think, the first uh, toll. The, uh -huh. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. I remember this is. Uh, like a comenzar. peaje, right? Mm -hmm. peaje, peaje, oh, yes. my God. I, so, uh -huh. so, something that has changed in our neighborhood. Yeah, because nowadays I, we have free space. Many years ago, we mm -hmm. visited. We visit. Did? Uh -huh, that's okay. Visited. Visited. Mm -hmm. visited uh, el, uh, el imposible. Mm -hmm. the, the mm -hmm. world, el imposible. Uh -huh. and, I, and I remember uh, this uh, water in a uh, in a uh, rocks and oh, uh -huh. and and on a uh, uh, cup like a copa de morro to drink <laughs> to drink water yeah. oh yeah, to drink water. now it's impossible to drink water from those yeah. rivers 
Yeah, because they are very contaminated. Contaminated. Yeah, so it has changed a lot. So that's why they have this conversation about the neighborhood, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, that's it. So 32 years living in Santa Tecla, a big change, a big change, mm -hmm. okay? What about you, Wendy? Hello, Wendy, I see Wendy here connected. Hi, Hi Wendy. Hi. Hi, very good to have you here. Uh, we are Thank talking you. about uh, we are talking about Wendy. You know uh, how things have changed from the past. Now we compare the past, the present, and we are giving our opinions. Okay, for the future. For example, oh, we were okay. discussing about the change of the neighborhoods, right? In the neighborhoods, uh -huh. for example, Eduardo said that in the past, uh, a few years ago, well, a lot of years ago, in Santa Tecla, there were a lot of parrots, trees, the weather was very nice. In these days, ve, ya se pasa presente, in these days, uh, Santa Tecla is hot and there aren't enough trees. And in the future, he considers that everything will be made of cement. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is many, like we were discussing past, present, and future. Many, many okay. towers, apartment towers. <laughs> Maybe, uh huh. It's true. They are building a lot of apartments, like like buildings, right? They're very tall, by the way. Very tall. Okay. So I don't know, Wendy, if you have lived uh, in the place where you live currently. Uh, how many okay. years have you lived there? I lived there since, since? Uh, 1992. Oh, okay. Oh, perfect. Has it changed? Uh, yes, it changed a lot. Can you please um, give me like a description in the past, then you compare it to the present? Okay. I remember a little because I have a bad I memory. Was? <laughs> ah, you have a short memory. <laughs> uh -huh. A bad memory. Okay, go ahead. Try to uh, remember. I remember that uh, the, there isn't, no, I'm sorry. There Plus. were uh -huh. uh, less houses. Okay, there, yes. <coughs> there was a... Uh, uh, a valley, like the valley. Oh, really? Beautiful uh -huh. then. Mm -hmm. But it disappeared. There are a lot of houses there today. So and they cut down the trees. Excuse me? They cut down the trees to make the house. Yes. Oh, wow. Yes, to make like houses. Uh -huh. Yes, the place is called uh, La Brisa. Oh, and there are a lot okay. of houses, a lot. Mm. And, and there was um, a few cars, mm -hmm. I remember back. There and were? There were? There were, okay. Uh -huh. There were a few cars and the, there, was, there were... Um, Football field. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. And down there, were, there were a lot of trees and vegetation, and there were a lot of parrots, green parrots. Oh. And what and happened to those parrots? I I don't <laughs> I don't know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and, but in the middle of the of the woods, okay, uh, there is a uh, way mm -hmm. that mm -hmm. it goes to the cemetery. Okay. So a lot of trees disappear too. Oh my god. So this is yes. this is very risky, right? Because there were yes. like a lot of people, you know, making houses. <coughs> it's okay to make houses, but the thing is that we have to cut down many trees. This is like yes. something bad, right? Unfortunately, the environment has to be like taking and part. Now they, mm -hmm. And nowadays, there are a lot of houses and cars and people fight for the parking lot. Oh, um, and I, I think the weather is hot. 
Yes, mm -hmm. it's Alara Hat. Okay. And, um, and about the 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 situation. Yeah. Uh, it's, the gang. It's more dangerous, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. It's very dangerous at night. Well, well, all day because um, before we didn't care about hear about. Um, murders or yeah it's true yeah. you're right about murders Rob, about robberies and nowadays mm. yes it's very common everyday life right yes <laughs> yeah what about the future Wendy are you positive or a little bit optimistic or pessimistic to the future <laughs> I'm not pretty sure um, I think it is um, going to get worse. Okay. Uh huh. Because um, in in my neighborhood, uh huh, there is a police station, but it's not working. Mm -hmm. I think the police and the gang have a agreement. A yeah. Mm -hmm. That usually happens. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And they are not going anywhere. They yeah, stay there true. and control the territory. So I don't think so, really. Okay, very good, very nice. Well, I'm very sorry about your your expectations about the place where you live. And this is, I think, it's not just there. It is everywhere in El Salvador. Uh, but let me congratulate you for the for the explanation because it was nice using the past, the present, and the future. That's it. That is what we want to 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 have here. This is our objective. So you can use the simple past for past events, present for describing what is going on in the present, and for the future, obviously using the future tenses. Okay, very nice. So in short, this is what we were discussing uh, yesterday. Okay, about technology to yesterday, Jose. Hello, Jose. We're talking about Jose and Eduardo. We're talking about education, environment. Okay, food. That's it. Today we're gonna focus a little bit of uh, people, okay? I'm going to ask you to give me your your little biography, okay? Talking about past, talking about your present, and then I want you to tell me a little bit about your expectations for the future, okay? But before we go on that, okay, um, we have this exercise from yesterday. We have to complete sentences with column A with the appropriate information from column B, okay? For example, here in number one, about 60 years ago, and then you have to look for the corresponding uh, second part, and it says letter H, many TV shows were in blank and white. Okay, yesterday, Eduardo told me about that. Uh, Pedro Infante, movies, right? Cantin Plus, uh -huh, and other ones. Okay, so I'm going to ask Jose. Hello, Jose, Jose. Jose Garcia, Hello. are you there? Hi, Jose. Hi. Okay, pretty good to have you here. Jose, can you help me to give me the number two and try to find the, the second part of the, the, second part. Okay. the structure? Okay. Okay, this uh, be before the automobile. Mm -hmm. mm. People didn't travel as much from city to city. Okay, people didn't travel as much from city to city. Very good. D. Very good. Letter A, letter D. Okay, let me let me have it here so we cannot make a mistake. Okay, letter D, you said. Right? Okay. Yes. Good. Very good. I remember when my grandfather used to tell me that in the past, if they wanted to travel to San Salvador, they had to travel on foot. My grandfather and my grandmother walked oof, Walk. kilometers, a lot, a lot of kilometers. For, 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 for days. <laughs> Yeah, it, it, it took them like a lot of time. It was difficult to go to San Salvador. Yeah, it was difficult for them. And the streets were not with pavement. No, 
The street where all the streets were dusty with rocky, you know. So it was kind of different. Aha, uh -huh. so before the oro. Repeat, Jose, automobile. Automobile. Aha, uh -huh. very good. Number three. That's it. Wendy, number three. And Eduardo, number four. No, okay. Uh, yeah. Okay, Wendy, number three, Eduardo, four. Mm -hmm. Before there were supermarkets, mm -hmm. people used to shop at a small grocery stores. Ah, the okay. Letter A. Letter A. Do you agree or not, Wendy? Um, yes. <laughs> now people prefer to go to the supermarkets, right? And to the, the supermarkets. Stores, and the grocery stores, but the small <coughs> ones are disappearing. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's true. Number four, Eduardo. Uh, in most offices, mm -hmm. this day, uh, people work more than 40 hours a week. Huh. Letter F. Letter F. Very good. Yes or no, Eduardo? Yes. How many hours <laughs> do you work? <laughs> in my experience. <laughs> uh, yes. Jose, uh, you work for more than 40 hours a week. Yes, I, I work around 48, 50 hours 48, 50 a week. hours a week. Okay. Supposedly, what time do you have to start working? Mm -hmm. Sorry? Supposedly, huh? what time do you have to start working? I start working at 8.30. 8.30, uh-huh. And you finish? I, 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 8.30, uh-huh. And, 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 and 6, 6, 6, 30, too. Uh -huh. 6.30. <coughs> 6.30. And sometimes at 7. Uh, no, uh, uh, between 6 and 6.30. Ah, okay, okay, very good. I was I was talking to some guys yesterday in my course that I have at night, uh, well, in the evening, and three students told me, hey, teacher, we're not going to continue uh, studying next next month. And I said, hey, why not? Yeah, teacher, it's because next month is more difficult for us. We have to, sometimes we have to finish work at 10 p.m., sometimes 1 a.m., 2 a.m., depending on the kind of work we have. I said, so, but you receive extra bonuses, I suppose, I said. Mm. <laughs> the same, the same money. So, what, the same money for more time. The only thing they have is the transportation to take them home. Wow, so. It's not, it's not, it's not like that, go to home. <laughs> yeah, ah, you don't want to stay? Well, F see you never, F see you never. Find other, find other jobs. Find other jobs, exactly. So this is the reality, uh-huh. This is the reality, exactly. Okay, number five. Go ahead, Jose, once again. In many cities. In, in many cities nowadays, mm -hmm. nowadays, um, pollution is becoming becoming a serious problem. Yeah, letter, letter B. B. Uh-huh, let me see, letter B, very good. Okay, in many cities nowadays, pollution is becoming a serious problem. And I think in El Salvador, San Salvador, well, all El Salvador is obvious that we are having a hard problem with the environment. With the, with, the, with the weather, for example, we are about to start November and it's very hot. It's raining. It's so diff different, right? Number six. Okay, Eduardo. Number seven, Wendy. In, in many classrooms today, mm -hmm. students are learning with interactive whiteboards. Aha, that's letter C. C. Aha, very good. Okay, in many students are learning with interactive. Okay, in this case, um, we can say interactive whiteboards. Very good. Well, I think not all the students. <laughs> no. In El Salvador, the public sector, they still have. Yes, <laughs> okay. Number seven. Um, I think it's in the next uh, hundred years. Mm -hmm. uh, there will probably be cities in space. Ah, there will probably be cities in the space. Okay, so that would be letter A E. Okay, that's it. What do you think? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> do you think that 
we, we, we will live in another planet or whatever. It's probably, uh, <laughs> Star Wars. Oh, like Star Wars, the, uh -huh, the movie. We hope that this year uh, there are floating boards. Mm -hmm. Like uh, in the Back to the Future, but uh, it doesn't exist. <laughs> uh, you like movies, huh? Yes, I like a lot. Of yeah, movies. a lot of movies, right? Uh, if uh, if just... if if someone found um, um, uh, water, that would be possible <coughs> to live in another country. If they find water, that water is is everything. Uh -huh. a lot of George, George Lucas is, <coughs> is the, Julio, the Julio Verne in the present. <laughs> ah. ah, Mr. Lucas. Uh -huh. George Lucas eh? <laughs> is, is Julio Verne. Julio Verne in the present time. In the present time. <laughs> okay, good, good. Sometime in the near future. So what is the only one that is missing? Doctors might find the cure for the common cold. The common cold, okay. Well, this what is, is the energy. meaning common cold? Ah, this is el resfriado común. Yeah. La gripe. <laughs> <laughs> no, come on, tell me maybe other kind of problems, like for example, uh, what? Cancer. Cancer. Uh huh, that would be great, okay. Or Alzheimer. Okay. Sida. Uh, Sida, okay. Uh, any other? <laughs> Um, well, those kind of problems, right? But common cold, we already have these kind of solutions, right? We're only with beta grip. <laughs> that, that's fine. Okay, now you're gonna show, okay, now you're gonna do it, okay, and we're gonna practice it, okay, but with this uh, describing the description of a person. It says here that you have to write, but obviously you're going to speak. Okay, uh, I want you to choose, I want you to choose a one a person that you know very well. Could be a part of your family, your wife, your, okay. Well, in the case of Wendy, your child. Uh, but I want you to tell me information in the past and the information for the present. And maybe some information that you know about this person for the future. For example, I'm gonna give you some information about my life. Well, I was born uh, in San Salvador. I was born on July 25th in 1980. Uh, I grew up with my mother and father uh, in, a, in a beautiful town, okay, near San Salvador. At the age of five years old, I moved to live with my grandparents. I lived with my grandparents for about 10 years. And then um, all my family and I moved to my own house. I started my, my education, I may say, at the age of five years old. When I was six years old, I could write and read very well. And then I started, uh, I was promoted to start my second grade because I, I learned how to read and write very fast. Then I studied uh, my primary school and secondary in a, in a small school. Then I started to study at Liceo Evangelico in San Jacinto all my high school and part of my, my ninth and seventh, from seventh grade to, to high school. After that, I um, started my university career at the University of El Salvador in 1998. And I graduated from Licenciatura en Idiomas in 2003. After that, I got my first job and I became a teacher of English. Now, right, I am talking about my present. Now, I, I currently work at a English Corporativo. I have 19 years of experience being a teacher. And uh, a, I have my own family. I have a daughter. She's about three years old. And uh, a, for the future, 
I I think I will I will continue working at the same place or I might start working at a university. Uh, also, uh, if God permits, I will have a second second baby. Okay, and then I will be over with my babies, right? <laughs> I don't want to have more. And uh, that's it. I think I will I will be a successful person, and I hope to retire at the age of fifty uh, five years. Okay. That's it. This is like a little biography of this is my my personal information. So I want you to tell me almost the same, right? When you started, when you grew up, when you were born, the past, then talk about the present. And then guys, you tell me a little bit about your future expectations, right? That's it. Who wants to start? Jose or Eduardo? Jose. Jose. <laughs> Where is Jose? Well, Jose is not here. Uh -huh. Jose, are you there? No, when Jose has the, the, the microphone muted, it's because he is not here. Uh -huh. Oh, Eduardo, so you have to start. <laughs> ah, come on, Eduardo, I see your camera. <laughs> Very good trick, huh? Very good trick. Okay, let's see, Eduardo. Try, uh, I'm going to help you. I'm going to help you if you have mistakes, okay, or, or, or any inconvenience. Okay, I am uh, 54 years old. Mm -hmm. I born. I was. In, I was born mm -hmm. in uh, uh, Texas Tepeque mm -hmm. in, okay. in in 1965. Mm -hmm. And when I had five years old, my parents was divorced. Oh, where, where? My where? parents were. My parents were divorced. And then my mother come back with her came? parents. Came, came. Came back, came, came back with her parents, my grandfathers, mm -hmm. my grandmother and my grandfathers. Mm -hmm. And I live, and I lived with them around uh, five years. Okay. And my mother, my mother uh, uh, tuvo otra, una, otra had, hija. Had. Had, had a, a other, other uh, daughter. Other, other child, uh huh? Uh, but not mm -hmm. my father. Ah, okay, with other person. With other person. Mm -hmm. uh, they moved to Santa Ana. Ooh. They moved to Santa Ana and, and I stayed with my grandfather. And your grandfather and, and mother. Mm -hmm. Mother, yeah. Mm. And around the 1988, I moved to Santa Ana to, start, to continue my studies at the fifth grade. Ah, okay. Yeah, five grades uh -huh. to to the to high school. 12, to the high uh -huh. school, yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. To finish high school. To finish high school, and uh, before I start my career, started started uh -huh. my career. Uh, my career. I graduated in nineteen eighty six. Okay. Uh huh. Very good. Uh, Technical, no, technic, tec, uh, engineer, electric, electrical engineer. Engineering. Ah, tec technician. Mm -hmm. Technician. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. In Santa yeah. Ana, Eduardo. In Santa Ana, okay. yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. In, in 1988, mm -hmm. yes. I start to job in San Salvador. Oh, to work. Work. Mm -hmm. I start my work in San Salvador. Mm -hmm. And the finish of these years, my family moved to me, to Santa Tecla. With me, with me. With me, yeah. To Santa Tecla. Santa Tecla. When, when you said your family is your, your mama? My mother and sisters. And sister, ah, okay. In, have, to, in, I, in total, how many sisters do you have? Two. 
Three. Three. Ah, okay. Three, and you are the only boy. Yes. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. What What else? And my first job. Mm -hmm. I I. ¿Cómo se dice? Que trabajé durante un tiempo. I worked. I worked. I worked for. Around four. Around uh, four and a half years. Four and a half years. Oh, a lot of years. Uh -huh. the, the second work. Mm -hmm. uh, In I, that case, my second job. My, my second job. Mm -hmm. I work around um, uh, 10 years. 10 years. Oh, more. Mm -hmm. And then my the, the the next the next job is mm -hmm. my own company oh i i, I start a company my own company your own company great yeah. very nice in, in the same years the earthquake in, in 2001 one destroy yeah. the company no oh, <laughs> No, it's, it's the same year, but in this. Oh my no, no God! Very nice, Eduardo. Very nice. Mm -hmm. And uh, in 2011, mm -hmm. I closed my company. Ay, ay, ay. And I, and I uh, just ten years. Yeah, ten years too. And and I start my new my new work in this. In this this agency. Ah, okay, uh -huh. great, very nice. I now, have, now in present, now. Now in present, uh -huh. now I have a, a eight a eight and a half years to work. In wow. This place. Wow. Okay. Very. And in the future. In the future, I I I think uh, me voy a jubilar. I will. I will. I, I will retire. I have retired. Wow, time. great. Hey, very me, good. Mm -hmm. Me faltan cinco ya años. But five years but are missing. Five years are missing. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Well, but five years go so fast, okay? Very good. Very nice, Eduardo. This is what I want to, 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 to listen, okay? Past, present, and future. Now, Jose, this is your opportunity, Jose, for speaking today. You are going okay. to... You are going to describe, Jose, your past and the present and some future, right? Oh, okay. Uh, okay, uh, for example, when you were born, where, uh, the time you were studied, the, your first job, blah, 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 in past. Then you move okay. to the current time. Okay, go ahead, Jose. Okay, uh, good. I born in Aguilares. I was born. I was born in Aguilares uh -huh. in 1916, 1976. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, because uh, my parents have uh, problems there, uh, they moved to Zacatecas. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So from Aguilares. And, and I and I grow and I grow and I grow it there. Uh-huh. Yes. Grew, grew, I, I grew. grew it there. Grew. Grew. Grew up. I grew, uh -huh. And I grew there. Okay. Uh -huh. And I studied in, in, uh, in Quesaltepec uh -huh. uh, okay. until uh, but high school. High school. High school. Uh -huh. High school. Uh -huh. high school. And I graduated uh, for to high school in 1993. Uh -huh. and, I, and, I start, and I started in the university ah, in okay. 1997. 1997. Uh, hey, similar to me. Uh -huh. I started uh, a Accounting. A public, public accounting. accounting. Mm -hmm. Public accounting. accounting. Public Where accounting. did you study, Jose? In Universidad Francisco Gavidia. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, but I 
abandoné. I quit. I quit my career eh, two and a half years. Oh, After really? Years. Okay. You were in the half way. Yes. Oh, my. Eh, and, and I dedicated only two jobs. To work. To work. To work. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. so, in in two in two two thousand two thousand seven. Mm -hmm. I beginning. I began. I I I, I began again. Mm -hmm. But mm, I not uh, counting. Uh, ah. Began had other other career. Other career, yes. What career did you start? Uh, Ingeniería en sistemas. Ah, system In, engineering. Yes, I graduate graduate uh, last year. No way, Jose! Really? <laughs> hey, year. congratulations! Thanks. Never is too late, huh? Good, you graduated last year. Very good. Okay, I I working in. Account, accounting. In accounting? Uh -huh. I, I work in uh, compras. Mm -hmm. Sales. 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 Uh -huh. and purchases. Uh, mm -hmm. Purchases. Mm -hmm. Correctly. Mm -hmm. And my first job was in 1995, around. Mm -hmm. Yes, 1995. Mm -hmm. And now I work in uh, Servicio al Cliente. Okay. Customer, customer, customer service. service. Uh -huh, customer excellent. Service. Uh -huh. and, and sales too. And in the future, what is your expectation? In the future, I, I pretend uh, mm -hmm. have, have, we have my my own company uh, restaurant I, oh restaurant i like i oh like cook <laughs> i like ah yeah 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 you love to cook uh-huh i yeah. like to cook yes oh, nice you have very nice expectations so you will have your own your own restaurant your own business yes okay very good i hope everything works fine okay that's great Thanks. very nice jose very good okay now wendy are you there, Wendy? Yes, I'm okay. here. Okay, similar, Wendy. I want you to talk about your past, now your present, and then I want you to talk about your future plans, okay? Um, we have to talk about ourselves. Yes, oh, oh, or, okay. or someone else, if you want to. Eduardo um, and Jose did it. Uh -huh. uh, they, they mentioned, well, they, they, they talk about themselves, right? In your case, Okay. You don't talk about you, but you can talk about someone else. Um, uh, <laughs> I don't know. I'm, I'm trying. Um, okay. I was born um, 21 July 1988. Oh, okay. 21st. 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 Okay. Uh -huh. In San Salvador. I'm San Salvador. from here. Mm -hmm. um, uh, I grew up in a house uh, located oh. in San Marcos. Ah. Oh, really? Uh, yes. Oh, originally I from San Marcos. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. My neighbor. Uh -huh. I lived there uh, from 1988 mm -hmm. to 1992. Mm -hmm. um, then I, we, we moved mm -hmm. to Sierra Morena, Seapango. Seapango. Mm -hmm. And I am living here uh, since then. Since, since then. I don't know if that's correct. Yeah, since then. Since then, okay. Mm -hmm. um, I went to the school near from my house. Mm -hmm. It's called uh, Colegio La Paz. I were there uh, from kinder. Mm -hmm. Four. For kindergarten so, four. And then I went to
Hello. Hi, Wendy. Hi. I think you got problems with her microphone, right? Oh, I was very interesting. <laughs> okay. okay. Oh, I just okay. mm -hmm. The application takes me. Is it me or the, the connection? I have the same problem sometimes. A las dos se les oye bien lejano. Really? Mm, okay, can you speak now, Wendy? Continue talking, Wendy. Well, I think she has problems, right? What about now, Eduardo? Can you Hi. listen to me? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So, Wendy, are you there? Uh, maybe she got problems with her co internet connection, right? Teacher, she's, what? she's there, but she's not there. <laughs> uh -huh, Eduardo? What uh, ba bandwidth is your internet? I'm sorry? What bandwidth? Supposedly, <laughs> supposedly, <laughs> suppo I said supposedly, I have five. Five, five megabytes. Five. Yeah, supposedly. But I was checking three days ago. I have like an application, right, for for uh, measuring. And it yeah, it's a, it's a speed test. Yes, and only counted three. No. So right now, when I am teaching my class here, what I'm doing is that I am a... I, I tell my, my family not to use anything from internet, uh -huh, uh -huh. Even, even to disconnect everything so I can use the van only with, <laughs> okay, for my, for my work, right? Yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm not going to change it yet because as I told you before, well, I have just some, some days more here in my house, then I will move to another place. So in that new house, I will have more. <laughs> yeah. I will buy 10. <laughs> ten no, 20. But, oh, God, how much? No. How much? Yeah, I, can... I, 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 I have 70 no. megabytes. Yes, in this, in this place, in my ah, company. Well, uh -huh. In your uh, house? In my, in my house, 10. Ah, okay. But I, I uh, for, for, three do, for more, for three dollars more, uh -huh. I duplicate, I will oh. duplicate the. the to 20. The, to 20, yes. Oh my God, that's better. That's better. Yeah. It does with Migo. Mm -hmm. With Migo. And with Migo? <laughs> okay, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think Wendy has this problem, right? Wendy, <clears throat> there was a very, very difficult to understand the last part, Wendy. I don't know if you continue being there. I see the microphone off. Okay. That's it. This is a, this is the, the part guys that we, we are going to be, we're, well, we already discussed, try to remember, uh, the, and, and, and this is my, this is my job here. Whenever I listen to you and you make a mistake and something, it's my, my obligation, right? Yeah, to correct okay. you, okay? So okay. any other, any other days that we are talking or discussing, if you make a mistake in past, I'm going to correct you, right? So you can improve. This is the idea to improve okay. every day. Okay. Uh, for tomorrow, we have uh, the next section. Okay. Um, the next session for tomorrow is, is, is about, you know, we have this one is this part. Okay. Uh, take the good with the bad perspectives. Okay. We are going to discuss about this, uh, but this is for tomorrow. Right. And uh, okay. Mm -hmm. Some things, a consequences okay we are going to discuss a little bit about that right let's conditional vamos a hablar del condicional uno okay si okay. usted no estudia no va a aprender inglés right that's it that is a conditional right tomorrow we are going to learn that this is the end okay of section number four because then we are going to start next week section number five because we are about to finish right that's it. Okay, I right. am very sorry. I'm very sorry for Wendy because she couldn't finish talking. 
since her internet connection is a little bit weak, I consider, right? So my friends, I will see you tomorrow. Do the plat. Oh, Eduardo, I have the answer from the for the the the, 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 the problem. The last. Yeah, yeah, no sé, Jose tuvo ese problema también. I talked to the person in charge of the platform and she told me that there was a problem, a spelling problem in the in the answer. So now you can do it, please. Okay, Eduardo, do it. Okay. Eh, so no sé si José le salió bien en a section. Eh, eh, what was it? Let me see. Creo que aquí tengo su. Complete the sentence. No. Yes, in the right, right, right. Era con el right. could you, could, could you, would you, would you mind in the midterm? Two, okay. two, no. Mm -hmm. The other. Okay, the, the, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> eh, the last one, eh, José, la última, había error de plataforma o ya está corregido para que le pueda subir le, le, el, el porcentaje, ¿ok? That's okay. it, ok, so you can do it that. Do it, Eduardo, and se, eh, take a, 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 a screenshot, right, and send it to me so to know that everything is working, right? Okay. Okay, do it then. Okay, okay, guys, it was a pleasure to see you once again. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, have see a nice day. Bye. Bye. Okay, bye. bye.